Over the last couple of weeks, several people have asked me about Strava and how you post and delete photographs. Well, here then is how you do it. Okay, so to begin, uh, open up Strava on your smartphone. So that will bring up your feed, uh, and if you've just done a ride, your ride will be the first thing that you see. Um, but unfortunately, um, the last ride I did was a little while ago, so it's brought up uh, one of my chum's rides. So to access your own rides, click on you at the top here, and that will bring up all of the rides that you've done um, that, are, that are actually stored on Strava. So you can just sort of scroll down and see pretty much every ride that you've done for, for the past couple of years or so. So let's come back up to the top here and see my last ride, which I did on the 9th of December. And it was actually a, a Zwift session. Now, when you do a Zwift session, Zwift will automatically post an image from that session onto your feed. Uh, and that's what you can see here. But if you want to add another photograph, uh, you can click on the title of the ride and then that brings you into the map page and in the bottom right hand corner of the the map page you'll see the the image so if you click edit uh, and now 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 we're in the edit uh, page you can see that the photo that Zwift has posted and to the left of it you'll see a little icon with a, a mountain and a sun now if you click that that will access your camera roll and you can add any photograph you like from your camera roll to your Strava feed. And just for a laugh, let's add a photograph of Olive from On The Buses. And click Save. And just to make sure that it's there, you can see on the photos, there are uh, there's the photo and a number two indicating that there are two photographs associated with this particular ride. So let's just click there and see what photos they are. There's the Zwift one at the top, and there's the lovely Olive from On The Buses. Now if you want, you can even say something about the image. So you just click here, and I'm going to just type a typical line from On The Buses. Olive cases. Uh, and if you've ever watched uh, On The Buses, you'll know exactly what that's all about. Click Save. And there we have the photograph and the comment. So let's come out of that. So then if you suddenly decide, oh no, I don't want a photograph of Olive from On The Buses on my Strava feed, again, come back in by clicking Edit. Click the photo that you don't want. Uh, and as you can also see here, you can set as the highlight photo or delete. Uh, if you set as the highlight photo, um, that's that's when it's posted instead of the map on your main Strava feed. So if we click delete here, there you can see Olive has gone, click save, and we're back to where we started. Let's come back to our feed, uh, and you can, you can edit photographs or add and delete photographs from any ride that you have on your Strava feed. So let's come down and find a ride that I did quite a while ago. So let's keep coming down, keep coming down and just pick one at random that doesn't have a photograph. Um, where are we? Um, it might be, uh, okay, so let's try this one here from March 2017. So the first half of the ride that the Garmin messed up. So again, let's click on the title. Uh, and then in the bottom right hand corner, you'll see the same little mountain and sun icon with a plus sign. Click plus, accesses the camera roll on the phone. And for a laugh, let's have a picture of a monkey on a bike. So there you can see it's now associated with the ride. Let's click Save. Uh, and there it is as the cover photo. So if you now click on the, the image, and there we have a monkey on a bike. So there you go. That's how you add and delete photographs on Strava. And if you're wondering why I've remade this film, it's because the user interface changes slightly from time to time. And indeed, the entire app is under constant development. So please stay tuned and I'll keep you informed of all the new features as they're introduced. Thanks for watching.